All right, so we're gonna do a taste test of the three different kinds of mushrooms we picked today. Um, we'll do this one first, and we're just gonna saute them in butter. Yeah, and there we go, one in there. I'm not gonna salt or pepper them or anything. We can add that after the fact, but I just wanna see what the mushroom tastes like without hiding the flavor at all. Three different kinds. We're going to saute each one of them in, in butter. I'm going to take them out. I'll wipe the pan out and uh, do the next one. That way there's no cross flavor happening. Look how bright red those get, those tops. I mean, they were kind of red anyways, but... They almost kind of look like red potatoes. Yeah, if you do. didn't take the peel off. And I'm only going to show you sauteing the first one here. There's no sense in showing you cooking the other ones, but when we do a taste test, we'll have them all set there. And I'm going to try them. My wife's going to try them, and maybe the camera operator Allie will try them. I don't think anybody else will end up trying them. No, no, Cecilia's saying she'll try them too. And when we try them, I'll remember the name. It's escaping me right now, but... Uh, yeah, I can't remember the name right now. So I'll think of that in the meantime. And, Almost makes me wonder if they were picked at different stages in their cycle because how much red, more red that one is. Or if they're different all together. Okay, we'll be back when we do taste test. So this is the barred tooth brucella. This is the Horn of Plenty, and this is the, the Puffball. Which one are you going to try first? That's actually really good. Yeah, it's really good. A little bitter. bit bitter after taste. Bitter. Yeah, it's a little bitter in the after. Mm-hmm. Not terrible, but a little bit bitter. Very earthy. And gritty. Very gritty in mine. Mm. This is supposed to be the chocolate flavored. The special one here. <laughs> is there a chocolatey flavor? I don't taste chocolate, but it's kind of sweet. Yeah. Does it have a morel flavor? Yeah, it tastes like more it's sweeter. sweeter. Maybe that's what it meant by chocolate. I like it. I like this one. Oh, you want to try it? Sure. Good. I'll try the chocolate. <laughs> it's unfortunate because this one's really good and it's The first bite it's is good. Maybe the smaller one's I'm better. I just want a little piece because it's cool. That one wasn't bitter. The small one? Yeah, which one is your guys' favorite? Or gross. The chocolate one? I just don't like the texture. Mm-hmm. It doesn't taste gross, but it doesn't like the texture. I like the taste of it. Maybe it's healthy. Can I just... That one was bitter. Try yep, it. even the small ones have Try that one. 
It's a different. Mm. Oh, this one. That one's good. Yeah. I like that one. So we got to differentiate between them. And it might be that those were a little older because you saw the difference in color. Yeah. yeah. There's one of two different kind of brittle gill mm -hmm. mushrooms. We were and I weren't sure couldn't decide which one was which. They're both edible. Yeah. Sure. I'm going to take the small one. Yeah. One with the red skin was good. This, this is bitter in the end. The chocolatey one is good. It just is kind of like a slimy.